The Green Diplomacy Division covers a wide range of environment and green related issues. Uh, we can begin uh, by introducing uh, GGGI and P4G, which are uh, international platforms that are engaged in green related uh, agenda, trying to assist developing countries. There are other international organizations and conventions, such as the UNEP and Biodiversity, UNCCD, uh, many, many other uh, institutions that we engage with. Another area that uh, we value very much is uh, marine environment. There are rising issues on plastic and marine debris that we are very concerned about and we are also making efforts to collaborate with neighboring countries on these matters as well. It is a very challenging and very exciting division that covers future and frontier issues. Well, first of all, we're very happy that we were able to bring together 67 leaders from different parts of the world, uh, more than 200 representatives from local governments, businesses, civil societies. We even had future generation participating at the summit. So lots of diversity. We also adopted the Seoul Declaration with a wide range of support from different countries under different circumstances. Uh, we believe that was an achievement on our part. The theme of the summit was uh, green recovery and carbon neutrality. So we were happy to see many of the leaders committing to recover green from COVID-19. And I believe that will set the foundation for us to achieve, uh, for us to pursue longer term climate goals uh, towards 2050. I think uh, your usual summits and meetings are more government focused and UN focused, whereas the P4G focuses on diversity. So we brought together not only governments, not only international organizations, but business representatives, civil society, the future generation, local governments. So many different people were uh, there at the summit to engage, to discuss how we can better address climate change. For the past 30 years, governments and the UN system, uh, we have made a lot of efforts to address global challenges such as climate change and uh, SDGs, and we have made tremendous progress. But what we have also realized in recent years is that we need more actors to participate. We need more engagement from businesses, from civil societies, from people like you and me, to join forces to, uh, to take action. Well, I think uh, we are placed in a unique position. Um, Korea has the development experience. We have the economic growth experience that will place us in a unique place on the international stage. So uh, when we start talking about climate change, I'm hoping that will also set a certain standard, a certain goal for other countries as well. And we hope that this effort that we make uh, on global issues will bring together uh, different countries under different circumstances so that uh, they can realize that uh, it is indeed possible to address uh, climate change together. And if we can be of assistance, if we can work together with uh, whether it be developed countries or developing countries, I think uh, this is the right time and I think Korea is uh, committed to do so.